Max and GNC, you ready? Right, Max, we're ready. GNC's go. And we're ready, Willie. No deltas. Copy that delta. DLG in it. Copy. Roll and right. I got it. Flight back. Go ahead, Max. FYI, I've just lost four separate. Uh, temperature transducers on the left side of the vehicle, uh, hydraulic return temperatures. Two of them on system one and one in the, each of systems two and three. Four high return temps? To the left outboard and left inboard elevons. Okay, is there anything common to them, DSC or MBM or anything? I mean, you're telling me you lost them all at exactly the same time. No, not said. exactly. They were within probably four or five seconds of each other. Okay. Where are those? Where is that instrumentation located? They're, all you four of them are located in the uh, aft part of the left wing, right in front of the elevons, elevon actuators. And okay. There is no commonality. No commonality. Max, tell me again which systems they're for. It's all three hydraulic systems. It's Two of them are to the left outboard elevon and two of them to the left inboard. Okay, I got you. My guidance for processing drag with good residual. Copy. Thank you. Hi, Juicy. Go. The area grounds were enabled for the landing count. Thank you. GNC flight. By GNC. Everything went good to you. Control and rates and everything is nominal, right? Control has been stable through the uh, rolls that we've uh, done so far. Fly. We have good trims. I don't see anything out of the ordinary. Okay. 
the tires feeling the heat pressure on left outboard and left inboard both tires. And Columbia Houston, we see your tire pressure uh, messages, and we did not copy your last. Is it instrumentation, Max? Uh, flight Max, yeah, they're also off. Roger. Off. Roger. Go. Go. Yeah, we're just taking a few hits here. We're right up on top of the tail. Not too bad. Hydraulic return instrumentations. Uh, no, sir, there's not. We've also lost the uh, nose gear down talk back and the right main gear down talk back. And flight ECOM? ECOM. I've got four temperature sensors on the bottom line data that are off scale low. I didn't go. I didn't expect uh, this bad of a hit on com. No onboard system config changes right before we lost data. That's correct. Flight all looked good. Still all on string two, and everything looked good. Columbia Houston com check. Five, five, go. Close in end point with the uh, one hour balloon shows is touching down at uh, 1496, 1500 feet down the runway. Our crosswind right now is on the left, from the left, on the 3 3 end. Columbia Houston, UHF comm check. But I'd like to stay where we're at. See them go erratic for a little bit before they went away, so I, I do believe it's instrumentation. Okay. Columbia Houston, UHF comm check. Five. Go. I know this date is a little late. Uh, the one hour balloon uh, protects us for wind okay, persistence. Houston, UHF comm check. I think we're in a smaller wind persistence case than that. In other words, uh, I was not reporting any RAF at this time. If I didn't go, SBC just, just should have taken us to state and low. Okay. Fido, when are you expecting tracking? One minute ago, flight. Columbia, Houston, UHF comm check. And why did you see no C band yet? Copy. Flight Intel. Go. I could swap strings in the blind. Okay. Command is over. Don't work, Flight. Flight Inco command string one in the blind. Inco. 
I have commanded string one in the blind flight. Copy. Bad data point flight. Uh, we do not believe that uh, was the orbiter. We do not have any valid data at this time. Okay. That we can go to. Let me start talking flight. My navigator. GC flight. GC flight. Why do you say lock the doors? Copy. Fido, do you have any tracking? No, sir. Fire. Go. My C bands uh, have not required anything. We are only uh, acquiring false locks at this time. I copy, Fido. The FCOH contingency plan procedure, FCOH checklist, page 2.8-5. Flight of flight. Go ahead. Do you have any information or reports from Space Command?
located on flight controllers on page 9 of the FCOH procedure, you need to make sure you step through the actions required in step 20. That's for your workstation logs, display printouts. There's a whole list of data collection items that we need to make sure we log through. I have the old mock BSC checkpoint, but we got a, we got an equivalent capability we'll, that we need to do. We'll get that done. GC flight. Fly GC. You understand how to do the end of file log tapes that we need in the yes, checklist? Okay. And folks, uh, listen up again on the flight loop. No, no phone calls off-site, outside of this room. Our discussions are on these loops, on the recorded DVIS loops only. No data, no phone calls, no transmissions anywhere into or out. And flight GC. GC. So we have no way of disabling the black phones. I understand. GC flight. GC. Bill, have you uh, sent out the TWIC? We're supposed to notify the other NASA centers via the TWIX, and the TWIX is on 2.8-3. We'll work it point as soon as we can, Bill. Copy. GC flight. Why do you see? Is the command system still armed? Affirmative. Let's save it. Copy. In code, we're going to save the command system. If why do you see? Check checkpoints on command server and track server have been completed. Final flight. Good flight. You're talking with LSO? Yes, sir. Okay. Um, John's going to go back and talk to Marty. Is Marty back there with Marissa? Yes, sir. Okay. Flight, go ahead, sir. Marty, can you confirm that the uh, DDS, DDMS folks uh, in the Dallas area have been mobilized to the extent we're able to? Yeah, RCC, the uh, Rescue Coordination Center, is mobilizing to that area, and they're uh, seeing what they can do to help us. Copy.